All right, I'm going to show you a very quick and easy way to use some of the glycerin that you get from biodiesel producers or um, if you get it yourself. Now what you want to do is you take your biodiesel glycerin, stick it in a can or whatever, take a you know, chopstick, a pair of needle nose pliers, and a Gerber multi-tool with a serrated edge blade. What you'll do is you'll take the cardboard egg carton, you'll just cut off a piece with the serrated edge of the Gerber, and then all you do is just take your dryer lint, you know, it's best if you get in a bunch of little pieces, and then all you gotta do is just stuff it in there. Just like so. Uh, you wanna, you, you actually gotta grab a couple handfuls because the stuff, it will soak in pretty quick, and then just mix it around until, until, you, until you really all the dryer lint just absorbs all of the um, all the glycerin. You don't want to have any any free, and the reason why you don't want any free is because then if it's goopy and stuff like that, then uh, the methanol will, will evaporate out, and um, and also you're just more or less just wasting. It also makes it harder to start. So you want it you want it somewhat dry, um, but not not really. Like so, you just stuff it in there. You know, this is just a small small batch just for demonstration purposes. And as you can see, it, get, it does get it does get harder to mix in with the more the more the more you put in there. Okay, that's that's good enough. And then all you do take your cardboard egg carton piece that you cut out. Take your needle nose pliers and just stuff it in, just like so. Nice and easy. Not complicated. You don't need to mash it in or anything like that. These things will give you, they'll give you about two to three, maybe five minutes of burn time. It just really depends on a number of things, such as how much you stuffed it. Um, you know how goopy stuff is. This is a little wet. Now I'm going to cheat slightly but my fire that I started this evening to cook my to boil my tea I use one of these and all you gotta do is just stick it in there that's hot and then I'll even give you a little demonstration they don't take too long to start if you make it right and if you're good with matches it doesn't take that long to get it started all it takes is one match and there you go. That will start your fire. Just let it run for a minute here. So that way you can see how much flameage it gets. Now it doesn't look like much, but if you have a continuous hot flame like this, and glycerin does burn pretty fast, it also burns very hot. Um, like I said, this this will burn out in about the uh, about three to five minutes, but this little itty bitty flame right here, with some tw with some twigs and some small branches above it, will get your fire started. And then, um, if you have a hard time keeping your fire started, then you're going to have to go back to your Boy Scout manual and learn how to keep a fire going. Anyways, hope you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment if you like. Thank you for watching.